Hey, how's it going? This is Brett from WebTech with Brett. And today I'm going to show you a very simple way that you can update your prices using WooCommerce on your WordPress store. During this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how you can update a simple product, a variable product, and how you can set up a special for your products. To follow along with this tutorial, you're going to need two things. You're going to need one, WordPress installed on a server somewhere, and two, you're going to need WooCommerce. So as you can see here, we have a blank e-commerce store set up now this is just one we've quickly thrown up for the purpose of this tutorial i've already logged in here but if you need to log into your store you can log in by going to your web address slash wp dash admin here we're going to have the basic wordpress dashboard now there's only going to be one area that you're going to need to go into here to be able to edit your prices and that's going to be your product from the left hand bar if we click products and go all products you'll see a list of all of our products for the purposes of this tutorial we're only going to be using these top two products but the rest of these are just dummy products to fill in space now this product here is a simple product if you click into that product and you scroll down to where you have your product data on the screen which is this box here uh, on your e-commerce site, this may be somewhere else, but this is the one you're going to need. You can see where it says regular price. Now, by updating this, you can update the price of your product to be whatever you'd like it to be. So just click update here in the top right, and that price will be changed. So on the front end of your store under shop, wherever our product is we can see it this is the product that we've just updated so it's 12 at the moment we change that to 15 click update we can see the prices change on the front end now if you guys want to set a special for this now there's a couple different ways you can do it you can do it either through marketing and create a coupon or you can just set it specifically on here so if we want to sell this for 13 dollars with a regular price of 15 we can click update on that, go back to our store, and you're gonna see the new price reflected just there. And you'll see that a sales sticker will appear when you have a sales price in the field. Inside your variable product, you're gonna notice that down in your product data, you no longer have the general box. That is because you have different variations which can have varying prices amongst them. So if you have variations in here where you've selected either a color, or whatever it may be that you're selling um, and generated your variations in here you can see that each of these options is going to have a place where you can edit your price under regular price so here where we've got ten dollars for our orange we've got twelve dollars and for our red we've got fifteen dollars you can also set individual sale prices on these as well now you can see here on the variation page we're going to have an overview of the prices listed here now once you choose a specific color, you're going to notice a change in price. Now that does it for showing you how you can update your prices in WooCommerce. If you do need a hand with WooCommerce, go to this QR code that you're going to see on screen. We do offer full-fledged WordPress and Joomla management, so if you do need that, then head to this website and we'll be happy to help you. If this video was helpful, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to this channel if you want to see more content similar to this. And until next time, thanks for watching. Peace.